but Tony Rudiger has good chances to join Real Madrid. The negotiations are advanced between Real Madrid and Tony Rudiger agents. Hey guys, and welcome back on the channel from Fabrizio Romano, as always, together to discuss transfers, players, managers, contracts, and many other transfer stories and insights in football. And today, guys, it's time to update on Tony Rudiger. Uh, we have some important things to share and to clarify. And so let's jump into it together. And so guys, for Tony Rudiger, I told you a few days ago that the decision is getting really closer. In a few weeks, it's really a matter of days, of weeks, we will have the final decision on his future, on his future club, because at the moment the situation is entering into the final stages of the decision. But Tony Rudiger has good chances to join Real Madrid. The negotiations are advanced between Real Madrid and Tony Rudiger agents, but nothing has been signed yet. This is important to clarify for Tony Rudiger, not with Real Madrid, not with any other club. He had a lot of interest from many and many clubs. So let's clarify the situation. Tony Rudiger's priority has always been to continue with Chelsea. He always wanted to continue with Chelsea, to continue with Thomas Tuchel, great relationship, to continue in London, he loves the city, to continue with Chelsea, with the fans, the stadium, the atmosphere into the dressing room. So he's always been so happy with Chelsea, but he wanted an important contract. He deserved an important contract because what Tony Rudiger did for Chelsea has been huge, even in winning the Champions League, the World Cup, he's always showing his commitment and the leadership of Tony Rudiger is something special. So he wanted an important contract to continue with Chelsea, but he had no agreement for many and many months and then Chelsea are now under sanctions and so they are not able to negotiate with Tony Rudiger. They can't do it till they have new owners. So Tony Rudiger, for two months, he was waiting for Chelsea to resolve the situation with Roman Abramovich, maybe to negotiate with the new owners of Chelsea, but now time is going on and still nothing on Chelsea side for Rudiger. That's why he's exploring many options. And so between these options, Bayern Munich are out of the race. It's not a possibility for them to sign Tony Rudiger because of his salary demands. Manchester United. Man United fans yesterday, they were going crazy for some rumors of meetings with the agents of Tony Rudiger. But what I'm told, guys, is that at the moment is not a possibility. It's unlikely and it's not a possibility for Tony Rudiger to join Manchester United. So he has different kind of priorities and he's not joining United. So not to Man United, not to Bayern. Same with Barcelona. They're going to extend the contract of Ronald Araujo. There is no doubt uh, till June 2026 with release clause 1 billion euros. And they will sign Andreas Christensen from Chelsea. So Rudiger at the moment is not a possibility for Barcelona. And if something, of course, if something crazy doesn't happen, guys, we know how it is for transfer market and for free agents, but at the moment is not a possibility that Barcelona are exploring after the meeting because they had the meeting with the agents of Tony Rudiger, but at the moment is not something advanced between Barca and Rudiger. And then we have three clubs that are really pushing in the last few weeks, Juventus, Paris Saint-Germain, and Real Madrid. So let me say that with Paris Saint-Germain there is a strong interest, approaches, but at the moment still nothing advanced because it's not close on what Tony Rudiger is asking and what Paris Saint-Germain want to offer. With Juventus, they are really interested in Rudiger, they would love to sign Tony Rudiger, but they know that they can't offer crazy money on salary point of view. And Real Madrid, we enter into Real Madrid, guys, because Real Madrid have always been interested in Tony Rudiger. Let me say that in December, if you are following my accounts, maybe you remember, and I always say it also here, that they always had an interest in Tony Rudiger. They've always been thinking of him. In December, he was a priority. Then they changed their strategy in January, in February, so they wanted to wait a bit. But they've always been in touch with the agents of Tony Rudiger. So Real Madrid always had him as top of the list. And now they're entering into the final stages of the negotiations with Tony Rudiger. So negotiations are advanced, but nothing has been signed yet between Tony Rudiger and Real Madrid. They are the favorites to sign him, but you know how it is with free agents. Till he's signed, everything can happen. They still need to complete many details before saying, here we go, Tony Rudiger to Real Madrid. So it's still in a situation that is really open. And it's important to say one point. Tony Rudiger has always been more than respectful with Chelsea. 
Tony Rudiger has been waiting for Chelsea for two months. And Chelsea at the moment, they are under sanctions, so they are not able to negotiate with him. But he's been waiting for Chelsea for a long time. So he was hoping for Chelsea to make a proposal. He's still hoping for the situation to change with Chelsea, but he knows that at the moment it's really complicated. And that's why many clubs are pushing, in particular Paris Saint-Germain, Juventus, and now Real Madrid, really insisting to sign Tony Rudiger really entering into advanced stages of the negotiation. And so, let's see what's next, but now Real Madrid are leading the race to sign Tony Rudiger on a free transfer. And so guys, uh, before uh, I ask for your opinion, as always, remember on Real Madrid that, of course, they want to extend the contract of, the, of Luka Modric. There is no doubt, Luka Modric will sign a new deal soon with Real Madrid. Same in the summer will happen with Der Militao and Vinicius Jr. So Real Madrid rebuilding is starting, but also they want to keep some important player at the club. And let me know your thoughts on Tony Rudiger. Which one is the best club for his future? I'm reading your comments here, guys. Remember to subscribe to the channel, guys. It's important to turn on the notification to turn on the notification bell, to like this video, because you know, guys, that we are entering into a crazy summer. And so I wait for you here on my channel. Ciao from Fabrizio.